and that's why you're going to stream. No, I, I don't want to stream it. I, I don't know why. Maybe, maybe it's just because like I, I play like, you know, like I, I'm big into fighting games. Yes. Um, and, and I'm, I am super, super excited um, for, for the PS5 in the regard of fighting games because the loads, you pick your characters, boom, you're playing all that stuff like that. Right. But the, the one thing that is super important in shooters, in fighting games, in, um, uh, we'll, we'll go with those two, right. Just for now. Um, but sure. When you're playing online, you have your own lag, right. But when you're playing local on a fighting game, if I'm playing with a friend, then the inputs are as, are as fast as, as the controller can send the signal to the console. And it happens right there. But if there's an additional step, fighting games are incredibly sensitive to, to lag. Like, it, it's literally like, it will completely change the way that the, that the game plays if, if, if the, the number of frames that it takes to register your input uh, changes. Um, this was an issue that Street Fighter had uh, when they had something like 13 frames of lag. This was, this was years ago. And, 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 and people, all the fighting competitions were complaining about how awful this laggy input was because it just doesn't play right. Um, racing games. You, you need that precise input, right? You, I need the car to turn when I need it to turn. And until you can give me one millisecond response times to the server, so from my console to the server and back with the frame, I, I just don't see it being a viable option. I can see RPGs. You know, um, maybe not so much action games like a like a Devil May Cry or, or any of those kind of any of those kind of things. And and I would imagine sports games at a high level would be tough to do that with too. You need to shoot the basket now. Mm. You know, you know it, that six milliseconds can make a huge difference. So now it's got to go, go to a server, go to a server, send the frame back to you. And if you're playing with on someone online, it's got to then go to. There's another call that's being done. There's a whole other operation that needs to be performed, which is tell the other person, hey, this is just, this is what happened. Actually, you don't even have to tell them. You just send them the frame. But they're sending information back, and they're looking at it from a different camera angle, right? So now the server has to decide which frames to send to these two people because right now it's like, okay, well, you input this, and I got this from you, right? I got this, I got this input from you, and now I'm sending this frame off with with your input to the person but on the way before that the 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 the, the your opponent received that frame they put another input and i can't say that that's super far from what it's like to have lag now but i just i just can't imagine there has to be that that, that would have to add complexity somewhere in the sense that just it, i don't think the experience is going to be what people think it's going to be I, I i just i just i i just don't see it I can see like, like assisted.